Hello everybody, my name is Pseudosaurus, welcome to an exciting new single player ticket series where I will be doing some awesome stuff, so let's mark this waypoint, that's with the common button, and let's get started. So Viper and I uh, just started a multiplayer ticket, and I want to do a single player as well, just to keep things, you know, separate and interesting, I guess. All right. Oh, this is um, this is rubber wood, but this isn't the same kind of rubber wood as um, as you need to make rubber. Oddly enough. This actually, when you craft this, this doesn't turn into planks, this turns right into sticks, which is kind of cool. I think I want to make a tree base. Alright, so I'm near water. It's gonna take forever doing it this way, so I'm gonna have to get a tree axe. Hello, piggy. Oh, those are flax seeds I just got. Oh, this is cool over there. That's just desert, I think. <laughs> I've done, like, a lot of uh, tree bases before, but it's always fun to, to do them again. Cactus, desert, alright. Whatever. I'm just going to head back over to where I started digging up that tree. I'm going to build or dig down and um, get some cobblestone in a second here. Once I get back there. Excuse me, pig. Where, where was that tree? This one. Okay. And then wherever I start digging, we can just make that a mine. Okay, let's go maybe over here. Yeah. I'll need dirt so I can plant some saplings. And maybe make a tree farm. You know the deal by now. Crafting bench is the first thing you make. Then you gotta make. You gotta do some sticks. And we're gonna make a pickaxe. And we're also gonna make a tree axe. Boom. Okay. Boom. So let's get a good amount of cobblestone here. So I can make a furnace and some tools. Man, it is dark down here. I think I have my brightness set all the way up too. Hopefully we can get some coal, 
So we can make some torches right off the bat. If not, we can always use some wood to make torches. I'll show you how to do that if you're not familiar with that process. I didn't know for a while actually how to do that, but that's, you know, especially when you're starting out and you, and you don't find coal, great trick. Um, also, if you run out of coal and are in a bind and you have wood and a furnace, you can do it that way. I'll show you. It requires wood blocks and um, what else? Copper. I think that's lava going blink, blink, blink. Uh, wood blocks and planks to make charcoal. Alright, so that's enough for now. It's almost a full stack. Let's get our crafting bench and take that with us. And then we're going to keep working on this tree cutting out process. Oh, grab it. Yeah. And then um, once we get this cut out all the way to the top, we're going to want to um, probably, well, I don't know that we really need fence, but I wanted to make it a little bit safer down at the bottom there because there's sort of a, like a gap, but it's not too far, so if I fall, it won't be in the end of the world. Wow, this is really large. That's cool. We're getting to the top here. Looks like it. Maybe. This could be a very large tree for all I know. some Indian food. I think I might order some later. They're like, oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah, well, whatever. Didn't ask you. I'm just kidding, that's not very nice. But, um, ooh. Wow. We're in a nice jungle here. Alright, so let's set up. Oh, stop, 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 stop. Stop, 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 stop. Ah, I just started walking around. There's a volcano over there. So have a nice little base up here. Maybe go get some um, glass or sand to make glass. All right, we need to turn off this wind. There we go. That wind is so obnoxious. It's like ridiculously loud. to get more regular um, tree saplings. Because I, I like these ones, but you can't craft them into planks, which, you know, you can make torches and fences all you want, but that's about it. Alright, let's put down our bench. And f let's see... See, yeah, check this out. Sticks. I mean, it makes a lot of sticks, but it's all it does. So I'll make some fence for up here. Uh, what else do we want? We want to make some tools here. So let's get some of these. Let's get um, some swords. Um, a hoe. You don't really need too many of these. 
Let's make some uh, shovels. And lastly, some tree axes. We'll get two of those. Okay. Very nice. Furnace. And we'll make a chest as well. Oh, look at that. Nighttime already. So we're going to put two of these in. Well, first we have to get some planks. We'll put in two wood here where the thing burns, and then planks as the fuel, and that will make charcoal, which is not the same as regular coal, but it does the same thing. It doesn't stack, though, with regular coal. Um, let me think. I'm going to kind of clear this out a bit to a common level and then fence in so we don't get any mobs coming in. It's like, I think they can spawn in trees. I'll make a nice wood floor here. some of these rubber wood blocks. But yeah, um, there are two different types of rubber wood. The other kind is the one that has the leaves that look like birch leaves. And um, went in the dark wood. And you can make a, what you call, what is that thing? A tree tap. And the tree tap will um, allow you to get what's called sticky resin and once I guess you extract that I'm not I don't remember so extract or put it in the furnace I think you can do either I'm not positive anyway and that that sticky resin turns into harbor and you can use that for making insulated wires and stuff it's very nice I like this. I do, I do. Alright, fortunately our hunger hasn't depleted much. That's always a problem at the beginning. Alright, so let's make a few torches here. And place our chest down. Somewhere. Here. Well, I want these. We need our dirt. And we can put up the fence. I got my hoe. Okay, just like that. Where do we want to fence in? So this is where the uh, entrance is. Here. I don't know, let's do like out here. These kind of look like marijuana leaves. The pattern on the here sort of looks like a marijuana leaf. 
Dot, dot, dot. Not that I know what that looks like. <clears throat> of course not. Why would I? Looks like a good start to me. Let's grab some more of those rubber wood blocks. Do some more flooring. And then we'll basically just knock back some of these to make sure that um, if there are mobs that spawn in the trees or whatever, they're not going to be able to jump over the fence. So, And I should probably just bring all these down. And then get rid of this so and fence it. Anyway, so how's uh, everybody's weekend going? I hope it's going well. Assuming this gets... No, it's, it's already Saturday evening, so this probably won't be uh, up on a weekend. How was your weekend? How about that? That's a better question. I hope you guys had a good weekend. Weekends are the best. Some more of this. Look at that, it's already done. Alright, so what I want to do next, after we put down some more fencing, is um, probably. Extend this back a little bit. Uh, I'm going to put down the what you call it? Uh, the, the seeds. I don't care. Alright, um, yeah, let's extend this over too. Just a little bit.
And what should we do next? After we plant those seeds. Hmm. I'm trying to think. Maybe go get more seeds. That makes sense. Seeds and saplings and actual wood. Not this fake ass stuff. It just it serves such a limited purpose. It doesn't serve all your regular plank purposes, obviously. And then I can guess we go, I guess we can um, make more fence for the downstairs area to make it safer and um, start going mining. Now that we have some torches too, we should make more more torches. Look at all of them spinning, spinning so happily. I, at least I imagine they're spinning happily. Oh no. Should have made another tree axe, but I'm almost done. Oh, an apple. Alright, let's put some of these bad boys down. Have a nice solid floor here. to stand. Oh, we do need to find some sheep. For sure. So we need some more. I thought I picked that up. This looks pretty cool. I like the pattern. At least I, I now have an apple, so it's some kind of food. Not eating meat. Nope, nope, nope. Don't do it in real life. Don't do it in here. Come on. What's that? Yellow flowers. Yellow flowers. How lovely. Alright, I think that's about enough for now. And... <laughs> Guys, I'm almost better. I'm still a little sick. Just a little bit. I've been coughing my ass off. But I'm I'm much better than I was. I'm not sniffling as much anymore. Still a little bit. But I can definitely deal with it now. And when I get sick, I'm such a bitch about it. It's really kinda sad. Alright, let me know if you see sheep. Don't know how you're gonna do that, but let me know. Not the seeing sheep part, the uh, letting me know part. But hey, I'm asking you, please, nicely, please tell me if you see sheep. And they could go door over here. Boom, boom, boom. There we go, this is a nice, this is turned out quite, quite nice. Good people.
That one's gonna bother me, isn't it? Ah, oh, there we go. Okay. Yay. Hooray. Alright, we can continue doing this in a bit. It's important now to go adventuring so we can get some of that taken care of. Hopefully we can get a few sheep. I don't think we're gonna have enough. Pretty sure we're not gonna have enough. <laughs> ah. What a lovely view of the desert. <laughs> oh no, we will have enough. Cool. Cool cool. Cool beans, guys, cool beans. All right, so that is set. Let's get these torches on the sides here, the corners rather. <laughs> Plop down our chest, table and stuff. Let's make like a, a work area right here. One thing I always say, you can always change it later. <laughs> so don't worry if you think you're doing something that doesn't look right or something. Either bench, bench. Let's make another, oh, make another chest. <laughs> Flaxseed actually is a good idea right now because um, when that grows, that it, uh, it gives you string. So we can actually use string instead of wool to make a bed. Um, I'm just gonna—I know it looks kind of bad, but just do this right now. I don't know if you need water for flax. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, you do need water. Which means we can go downstairs and plant it. Oh, I should put a tree up here too. A few trees. Let's see if they grow. And, alright, let's head down there. Keep the flax seed with us. And uh, go from there. Do do do, awesome tree. Do do do, awesome tree. Yeah, this is where I was talking about, but that's not a big deal. All right, and we have our spawn point set there on the waypoints. Um, we're gonna go down to the water. We can't make a bucket right now because we don't have. Um, oh, to you too. We don't have iron. I f what is it? What is it with, uh, flax? What do you need for flax? Maybe it needs to be hydrated. Come on, hydrate. One of you hydrate. Ah. Let's just mark this real quick with a torch. What kind of meander around? Where's the where's that pesky sun? I bet it's already nightfall, isn't it? So 
it looks like. Yeah, okay. Back to the tree. And I'll set a waypoint for the tree, just so I know where the base is. The base of the tree base. Um, let's see if I can get this. Just want some saplings. Just want some saplings, okay? All right. If we get this and the other one. I left another floaty one. Ow. Sorry, my back hurts. Because I'm sitting weirdly. Well, why don't you fix it? That's a good question. So I showed you how to make charcoal. <laughs> yeah, I got a second. Just like in the little wood, I love saplings too. Because if we didn't have saplings, we wouldn't be able to do anything in the game. Everything starts with wood, including babies. Alright, one will be fine for now. We can get more later. So let's head back up here. Man, it is dark in here. I love this base already, this is really cool. So happy with it. All right, let's plant our sapling get down. Um, let's see. Need some apples. Cool. Uh, that was so much fun. Let's see. We should have yeah. So let's get some stuff. So that'll be good for now. Just waiting on this charcoal. Oh, you know what we can do? I think we can also put sticks in this fuel. <laughs> yeah, you can. They just go a lot quicker. Alright, so let's grab that out. Sorry, I'm texting. And put everything away. Stupid iPhone keyboard. Terrible. Um, Alright, I'll put the hoe away. This should be fine for now. Um, what do we always need to bring with us? Wood. Let's bring some wood. I would bring food, but I don't have that, and I do have torches. So let's at least get a little preliminary bit of mining done. Maybe get some coal and some um, iron, I hope. Oh, that's on the bottom. Okay. Mine, mine. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, 
Oh, that sounds fantastic. Oh, that's right. I need this. Yeah, there's there's definitely some kind of volcano pull down here. Oh, I'm a new ore miner. Achievement get. That's because Tekkit has um, different ores, uh, quite obviously, because copper doesn't exist in normal Minecraft. And obviously they all have their own uses. There's copper, tin, um, I think. Oh, yay! What else? Copper, tin, um, what, what's that blue stuff called? What's that blue stuff? It's kind of junky, but you use it for blue tricity, the blue, all those different blue things. Oh, we found a cave. Excellent. Hopefully it will be worth something. I guess let's go this way first. fast. I don't know. There's we'll, we'll go through all the different ores and what they do. It is, I guess, what the point of what I was saying. Sort of. Um, yeah. It, it will just be easier to discuss what they do when we find them. I can't remember the name of that blue thing anyway. It's like a light blue dust kind of thing. It's sort of like lapis and um, uh, redstone in that it comes out in the, like those packet kind of things. That's what I call them. Packets. Little pouches of goodness. I could probably look it up in the in the wiki or in the menu. Uh, any I menu, not enough items. That's yeah, but I just don't really feel like it right now. Sorry. I'd rather just find it and then talk about it later. <laughs> At least I know what it's for. At first, I couldn't really figure out what it what it did because I'm trying to remember. I'm not sure if it has um, any MC value, meaning if you can use it for, um, uh, what do you call it, equivalent exchange, which is transmutation in Tekkit. And transmutation allows you to um, turn cobblestone into diamonds, essentially. That, that kind of idea. You need a certain um, tool to do it, not tool, but um, uh, object called an energy, energy condenser and you set a target so you say my target is going to be a diamond you place a diamond in the thing and you put in stuff that has an EMC value like dirt uh, dirt and sand glass all have an EMC value of 1 the diamond is 71.92 I think I forget exactly Oh, hello, lava, you bastard. We're at level 46, so I'm just kind of... Oh, I, I need to make iron to do that. And I brought wood, so I can actually do that right now. This is ruby. Ruby has the same, essentially the same properties as um, diamond, in that it um, 
has the same EMC value, has the same, the tools and weapons all have the same um, durability, I guess, and, um, and so on, so. Um, never worked. So much stuff. Let me go back out. Glowstone, dust, lapis. Um, that, uh, that was it. Nicolite. Nicolite is kind of. It's not useless, but like I was saying, it has pretty limited use. Alright. First iron tool. Awesome. So let's get these rubies. I think they're rubies, right? And then we can make tools out of these. Awesome. I like because there's, um, you can actually see right here, ruby, emerald, and sapphire and um, the tools are just really pretty all right so we'll keep those around I'm sh yeah okay I'm shoveling that's smart uh, where to down here maybe Another cool thing that you can do, just off the top of my head, I'm thinking, is, um, what's it called? There are these things you can make, um, crap. Well, the, the one thing is a talisman of repair, which will repair your tools for free as long as everything's in an alchemical chest. Um, but the thing I'm thinking about is a, it finds the value of, let's see if we can find it. Like you, you right click on a block with it and it finds the value of a sickle. The, I don't care about sports, stop sending me things about sports. It tells you the value of the highest level mineable ore in that direction. I love bags, they're awesome. There's the talisman of repair, dark matter, of course, covalence dust, red matter, lovely. Here, here we go. Divining rods, three of them, three levels of them. So you can right click and it'll say, oh, there's 16,000 EMC down here. So that means, oh, there's gotta be two diamonds. Well, not necessarily, could be, could be rubies or Emeralds or sapphires, I guess. Yay, more iron. Lovely. I, I just love Tekkit, though. It's, it's a really... It's a great way to expand the Minecraft... Um, can, cannon's not the right word I'm looking for, but... Your capabilities are 20 fold what they are in regular Minecraft. I love regular Minecraft for its, all its limitations because that's truly, I think, what makes a great game. Not always, but in this case. Um, and, and really, the, the fact that, I mean, literally, you're, just, you're building out of blocks. What can I do? How can I do this? Um, At uh, Minecon in in uh, at Disneyland Paris, um, I think they were asking Jeb about wireless redstone, for instance. Um, would you ever integrate wireless redstone into the game? And he was basically saying, "I don't think that really makes sense because at the end of the day, redstone is a very physical thing, and the fact that you have to." 
you know, place it down and follow all these specific rules about how it works and how it won't work. The limitations of it actually make people do things um, smarter, better, more creatively. You know, it makes you rethink how you're going to do a certain process. So that's Nicolate over there, guys. I just picked up silver. There's also, I think, tin. Yeah, little packets of Nicolite. I know. I was at first. I was like diamond. It's not diamond. Nicolite. But it, it will come in handy uh, if we start getting into blue tricity. That's a. Um, there's so many mods built into Tekkit. It's uh, ridiculous. But the blue tricity mod is where that comes in handy. So let's go down to eight. I think. Kind of dig forward for a little bit. See if we can't find something interesting. This has already been a pretty successful mining trip. You guys? Redstone, lovely, lovely. Ow, my butt. Ow, my butt. Cause right now I'm sitting in my friend's bed, but like I'm leaning against the wall. Oh, excuse me for a minute. Hello. I can't be here. Uh huh. You made it seem like I could stay here. Is that okay? Thank you. Yeah. Um, you said what's not happening? Indian food is not happening? What do you want? Okay. Okay. All right, cool. Bye. Oh, sorry about that. Let me text. Texty, texty, of course. Let's do a little bit more mining. And then head back up to the surface. Man, I can't wait until we get a quarry up and going. Ah, 
What happened? Actually, I do want to try something real quick. I'm going to cheat something in and see if it works because I've had success with it on some TechEd servers I've played on and not, uh, no success on other ones. So, the uh, diamond pipe, it's for sorting. Um, there, there are two main ways of sorting, at least that I know of. One is that diamond pipe, the other is through pneumatic tubes and the, the thing called the sorting machine. Um, the sorting machine on the last ticket server we made would work and then stop. It would just stop working. For n I don't understand the reasoning behind it. It may have had um, problems resolving the destinations because with pneumatic tubes they will actually resolve the destination first and then before and, and then it will send it. Um, whereas with the diamond pipe or just any kind of pipe like that it just plain sends it and then if there's a gem up later you know it I guess sends it back or something but the pneumatic tube can sense if there's a gem up before it does anything so alright I say go let's do another minute or two and then we're gonna head back up because this is getting not too well we're getting some stuff Got a surprising amount of iron already, I guess, so. But I'd rather just go back up. Shortly. Oh, well, if we need nickelite, now we have it. Hello, bedrock. And some up there. So I figured out it's, uh, what is it, a six? Need six diamonds to be able to make a condenser. And if you want to make, if you want to condense a diamond, you'll need a seventh. So. It's quite a startup price, but totally worth it to have condensers. They're awesome. And then you can actually condense condensers if you have enough EMC. Alright, uh, we can make more coal if we need to. I hear lava burbling away somewhere. So maybe we should try to find where that is. Bubbling, I, I think, is the right term, not burbling. Now these ruby, sapphire, and emerald tools cannot be enchanted. Obviously the emeralds are not the same emeralds as added in 1.4 because those emeralds can only really be used for trading and can't be turned into tools. So. Alright, I think that's going to do it for right now. Let's head back up these crazy um, through this, this passageway and stuff. Well, look decently. And obviously walking out is going to be easier than tunneling. But we're pretty far out. Lava room to make it a spa. So that wasn't exactly what I was thinking um, when that opened up. I thought it was going to be more of a traditional 
cave system instead of a lava room, but that's okay. We got some good stuff. Um, that's a good start. Thank you for the egg. Alright, are there any is there any tall grass here? Oh, there's some over here. Let's see if we can get more seeds. Flax seeds will do. Now that we have iron, we can oh that scared the hell out of me. We can make a bucket so we can bring some water up to the base. Is he gonna attack me or is he stuck? Or just dumb? Yeah, uh <laughs> two two. Alright, let's get out of here. Go back home. I like this tree base a lot. And we should put a um put a fence gate up here. Craft that real quick. Do I have planks on me? And skate so we can be safe from the bad guys. Whoa, lag city. Come on. Here? Smelt up this iron first and foremost. Throw away all this stuff in here. Boom. <laughs> Look at all those things. We are making progress here, folks. So these are all good things. Let's make sure we can plant our seeds here. Got that hoe. So obviously this is an important thing to do. We'll make a legitimate garden later, but this is fine for now. I don't know if those other trees are gonna grow, but we'll see. Anyway, thank you guys for joining and building my wonderful tree base with me. So, we'll see you next time. Bye!